What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Today, I wanted to share with you 10 women's clothing brand items that can sell for good money on eBay. These are all items that we have sold in the last month or two, basically in 2024. Um, these items range from $40 to $140. Let's not waste any time and let's get right into the video. If this is your first time checking out one of our videos, I do appreciate you stopping by. My name is Ari on Instagram and on YouTube as Nothing New Thrifts. Together with my wife, we run a 3,800 item eBay store, currently doing about $15,000 a month in sales, um, but we will be ramping that up. Again, let's get right into the video. Thank you guys, let's go. All right, first item of the day is definitely one to look out for. Um, you're gonna wanna look out for like their blouses and tops. They can be colorful, they can be plain. Um, the tag comes in a lot of different like styles. So you just gotta start to uh, learn what they kind of look like. Um, this was a Johnny Was full zip sweater um, with a beautiful floral print. We sold this for on an offer of $40. It wasn't extra small. Um, yeah, uh, any better or bigger of a size, you know, would have just gone for more money. But very nice sweater. I'll show you guys the tag. This is the tag on this one. Um, this is a common tag that you'll see on, a, on Johnny Was. All right, next item. Next item is a brand new brand for us. Um, this was our first time finding this brand. We picked it up, listed it, and it sold, I think, within like a day or two. I think same day we listed it, honestly. Um, this is a Margaret Howell shirt, women's um, size two. This was a three quarter sleeve top, made in Japan, caught our eyes for a couple of reasons. Um, anyways, this sold for $42.50. Oh, we're a little out of order here, um, just by a couple of bucks. But anyways, um, next item is going to be this vintage baby fat. Oh, you know what? I didn't show you guys the Margaret Howell tag close up. Boom. There is the Margaret Howell tag. Real nice and clean looking tag. Um, yeah, nice and simple. Margaret Howell. Okay. Next item was this vintage baby fat jacket. Um, I don't think sell through rate was great on these, but I think people were asking for a lot of money. Um, we just priced ours pretty low and I think we ended up taking an offer for $40 on this, but baby fat does have some items that can sell for good money. Um, so definitely, you know, be on the lookout for baby fat items and check, um, check them out when you do come across them. Do we see the tag already? Yeah. Okay. Next item up is a classic um, item here on this channel. We do find a lot of it. Um, not a lot of it, but more than you would think. Um, the brand is Aviator Nation. This was just a simple Aviator Nation t-shirt um, with like a nice cropped um, cropped fit. Yeah, it was cropped short, uh, cropped length. Anyways, uh, we listed for $55 and we accepted an offer of $47 on this Aviator Nation. Um, this is probably one of their more popular graphics, this like Thunderbolt graphic. This is the colorway to look out for, this uh, red, orange, orange, yellow kind of color. Um, this is the inside tag. You can see this shirt from like a mile away from the back when people are wearing it because you can see this giant like four inch by three inch rectangle on the back of the neck. Um, which is the stitching on the giant inside tag. Um, yeah, Aviator Nation, solid bolo to look out for. Next item is a pair of snow pants. This was a Nike ACG women's snow pants. Um, we had listed for $80 and we accepted an offer of $59.95. Um, I think this is kind of a no brainer, you know, if you see this, at the thrifts or at the flea for a good price. Um, I actually bought these off of a buddy. Um, he gave me a good deal on them. But yeah, um, shout out to my boy Chris. Um, yeah, Nike ACG all conditions gear. Also another little bolo in there. Nike ACG stuff is pretty popular um, within the Nike community. Yeah, Nike ACG. I say that sold for $59.95, they sold for $59.95. All right, next item. This one's cool. Next item, um, I've been on the lookout for these Seven for All Mankind Dojo jeans for like two years. Um, I've 
I've seen, a, you know, hundreds, thousands of pairs of these Seven for All Mankind jeans. I've never seen a dojo pair. Finally found my first pair, and they lived up to the hype. Um, sell through rate was there, price was there. Um, we did not accept an offer on these. These sold for full price, $69.95, probably within a couple of days or a week of listing. Um, and you'll notice the dojo because inside of the tag, it says seven for all mankind dojo. I gotta do a better job. Like while I'm talking, I gotta move the picture so you guys can see the thing. Um, this is my first time doing uh, like a what sold or whatever in a, in this format. Um, so yeah, I'm learning, but this is kind of easy. So I think if this works, I'll be, um, I'll be able to crank these out and um, more videos a little bit, a little bit easier. Um, anyways, okay. Next item is not necessarily a women's clothing or women's brand. Um, this could be uh, used by, you know, anybody, but uh, I wanted to throw it in here because it was a recent sale. This is a vintage San Marcos blanket. Um, yeah, vintage San Marcos blanket. Um, shout out to my buddy on Instagram. Uh, he keeps changing his Instagram name, but it's Market Underground. Um, I'll pop it up right here if I if I can. I'm sure I'm sure I can. I'll edit it into the video. Um, he taught me this bolo. But anyways, um, these vintage like Mexican blankets, Mexican cobijas. Um, you can check the tag if it says San Marcos. They're sought after, and depending on your print, it can be you know more or less sought after. The lions are pretty popular. I was gonna list this for like. I don't know, like 70 bucks or something just to get rid of it. Um, my wife actually listed it and she checked comps a little more thoroughly and she listed, she decided to list it for 125. Um, we accepted an offer on that of $80. Yeah, not bad at all. We got a couple more items to go. Um, we're almost done here. Next item up is, uh, oh yeah, this is, this is just an extra one I threw in here. Um, this will be, there, so there will be 11 items in the video, but one more Aviator Nation sale. Just wanna show you guys again, another example of the tag. There's a little logo again, real simple. But again, boom, the big, beautiful lightning bolt graphic on the back. Um, we listed for a hundred bucks and we accepted an offer of eighty four ninety five on this Aviator Nation women's hoodie with all this like crazy fading that you might think is no good. Um, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Oh crap, hopefully I didn't show nothing over there. Um, yeah, a little Aviator Nation. All right. Um, this one was cool. Uh, I remember paying 10 bucks for this at the swap meet and thinking, you know, we got a pretty sweet deal there. Uh, we listed for 115. It sat for a, a little while, um, but I think it's, a, yeah, it was a woman's small. Uh, goose down, like Nike, USA Olympic team. Uh, what's going on? USA Olympic team. Uh, I think it was reversible. Or no, it was reversible. It just had this crazy, like, graphics on the inside. Um, yeah, pretty sweet, man. Pretty cool jacket. Uh, again, we accepted an offer of $86.21 for whatever reason. Maybe we sent that offer because um, we just sent 25% off offers. We don't like nitpick what we're going to send or we don't choose dollar amounts on our offers. We just send 25% off on everything possible to send offers on. Um, yeah, pretty cool little uh, find here. This is the kind of Nike stuff you want to look out for, you know? Um, next item, and we're almost done. We only got two more items left. This item is an Everlane item. Um, we found this brand new at the thrift. I think we paid $10 for it. Um, it pays to be nice to the employees. Um, yeah, you know, when somebody's going to judge an item, whether it's going to be 10 or 20 at the register, you know, if you're, if you're on their good side, you know, it's, it can be good for you. It can be a uh, lucrative. Um, all right. So anyways, this is an Everlane coat. Um, this is like a brown trench coat, um, like a very, uh, like a full length, whatever coat. Um, again, it was new with tags and we sold this for full price, $89.95. Probably took just a little while to sell, um, maybe a month or two, but yeah, not a bad sale there at $89.95. Um, good little bolo to, uh, good bolo to be on the lookout for. Um, good item to be on the lookout for. And that's it. We got one more item on the list. This is a really good one, though. Um, 
this is a low key item. I think a lot of people would pass on and um, a lot of people would not even like see it or know it or uh, whatever, or find it. The brand is called Jenny Kane. If you look that up, it has really good sell through. Um, some items have crazy high pricing. Um, this was just a real nice, like simple sweater, but it was cashmere, wool, viscose, polyamide, polyamide and cashmere, AKA cashmere blend. Um, this is the tag. It's just black on black, so it's hard to see. Um, it's like a black label with black stitching. It's kind of dumb. Not dumb. It's it's cool. Um, it's just hard to see. Anyways, Jenny Kane. Um, we listed for one eighty nine ninety five. Even though it's a little kind of like misshapen like that. One eighty nine ninety five, and we accepted an offer of one forty two forty six. Um, again, that was probably us sending like the 25% off off on that or whatever that was. Um, yeah, that's it for today. That was uh, 10 or 11 items, uh, 10 brands, 11 items, uh, women's clothing items. Again, we don't specialize in women's clothing. We do mostly men's, but we do um, come across some women's. And since we don't pick up a lot of it, we only pick up the good stuff. So I want to share with you guys some of those brands. I know... Um, some people don't dabble with that at all. Um, so yeah, you know, you can start start with a couple of couple of items in your pocket that you can know that are, are kind of sitting out there waiting for you to find. Um, that's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll be doing a what's sold uh, or what's selling for uh, men's clothing brands as well. Um, be on the lookout. Be on the lookout for that. Um, thank you guys for watching to the end of the video. I appreciate it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet hit the video with a like uh, drop a comment if you learned a new brand or anything interesting or if i'm wrong about anything i appreciate that as well and catch you guys on the next one peace